Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of the Library of Ruina. Uh, the subscriber goal continuing to climb. We are at 182 of 200, which means 18 more people subscribing. And you guys have got yourselves a Library of Ruin episode with a face cam. Um, yeah, we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. Like I said, uh, depending on when it happens, we might do some new content that's been released. We might do some of this content, depending on how long it takes for us to finish it. Or we might go back and do something really hard <laughs> that I think could be fun to, to do with a face cam on. We'll see. We'll see. I haven't quite decided yet. Um, that's kind of that's kind of my thought process at the moment. Um, but I think today we're just continuing on with the regular stuff. I did go through and grind out a couple more of these books, both for the key page and also the, the stuff like the pages, the combat pages. So we have a couple of excess here for us to use. Um, I'm interested, to say the least. We'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, that's right. There's no voices. It's 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 all on me. And also, a bam. Purple tear. I have done as you instructed me. All that's left is to settle this my way. Okay. Greetings, dear guest. Purple tear was right. You're nearly indistinguishable from a human now. At the same time, the power of the library which protects you has gotten weaker. What is the meaning of this? You should be more careful when your body is made of flesh rather than metal. But it seems you can't die from having your head chopped off yet. Ah, <sighs> I suppose I can't. I was wondering what you were up to. There's still an abundance of options that don't involve killing. Oh, okay, shit. What? A workshop crafted assassination device with T-Corp Singularity applied to it. Bought just for you. You may have power, but you're certainly gullible. That's what happens when you accept handshakes from those who oppose you without having a hint of doubt. First it paralyzes the target, and when I put... Oh. Roll into the rescue. And when you press that button, it activates for a single second. A single-use device with surefire effects. The device overloads the human brain, causing their mind to experience a thousand years of time passing by. Which is more than enough time to ruin the average person's brain. Just like the warp trains, huh? Olivier, you went to the lengths of the world to join the Hand Association. Now you resort to this extravagant little gadget of doom. Did you blow your entire fortune on this thing or what? And you spoke too much. Been a while, Roland. I was waiting for you to show up. So you've been guarding this monster mimicking a human all along. Well, now, she's no monster, you know. She's my responsible boss and a good friend. Angela, I'll deal with this fella on my own, so please back off for a bit. Thanks. You don't need my help? I have to take care of this matter on my own. It's between him and I, so you don't have to worry. Alright. You can call me anytime you need assistance. Roland. Is this what your big plan was all about? Is this really worth it? What you're doing isn't any different from all the tragedies we've seen and gone through. You've been perpetuating it in the library with that machine. I won't expect you to understand me. Take these. The Gloves of the Black Silence. Let's say we have even score now. Okay. Thanks. As always. I miss the feeling of these. With this, I got all the help I could ask of you. I'm partly responsible for what happened to you, which led you here. You have no idea the mess I had to clean up after you went missing. Neither of us had parents or any real family, so you probably thought no one would be concerned about you. And you were wrong. I was actually pretty worried for you, unlike some others in Charles' office. A bunch of thoughts came to mind when, I, when you left after making a lengthy ramble. Not long after that, I heard news that a person who appeared to be the Black Silence went on a crazed rampage across the city. It said he was slaughtering syndicates that were doing suspicious experiments left and right. His wave of destruction didn't discriminate. Even Fingers and Fixer offices were caught in its wake. I almost had to question myself for a moment when I heard that you crushed a good half of the middle in the south. It was as if you were venting out all your frustrations and resentment on the city. If that were the case, I thought you might keep going and demolish the city itself out of sheer anger and madness. Come on, you're blowing things out of proportion again. Anyone would have thought the same thing if they had looked into your eyes behind the dark mask at the time. Thanks for worrying, man. I was concerned you might have died an unfortunate death somewhere out there. This was a long time ago, but you wouldn't have survived if I hadn't gotten to where you were after you contacted me back then. I appreciate you coming over to help me with- along with that- oh wait. 
I appreciate you coming over to help me along that short call that day. Sorry about what happened next. Never mind it. I only rushed to save your ass because you said I might get a, a nest migration permit. I'm sorry for all the trouble. How are the others doing anyway? Like, uh, Ogier or Ast Astolfo? Joining wings, exploring the ruins. They've found their ways to make a living for themselves. We just aren't how we used to be. We've grown too distant. I see. Say, remember when the two of us handled an urban nightmare case for the first time? He, uh, what was that case called? The Secret of the demi glace Sauce, which occurred in the back streets of District 12, uh, District 16. I d didn't say it's District 12, you, you misheard. <laughs> yeah, that. We were just about done with it, and then your arm got almost got caught in a blender at the last moment. Though, thanks to me, you saved yourself the need to get a new arm. That was one thrilling job. Ugh, let's set the record straight. None of that would have happened if you hadn't tried to take a sip of the sauce out the ladle to see how great its taste must be to cause an incident. Come on, man. Can't you let some of my, can't you let me come out on top for once? Those were the days still. We didn't have to worry about too many things, and just stuck to the matters at hand. Yeah. But you know we can't go back to those times anymore, Roland. You swallowed your anger and sadness to work with that machine, so I don't doubt that you prepared yourself for a lot of things. I know. Both of us have gone too far down our roads. It was nice talking to you after a long while, though, Olivier. I'm only doing my job as a fixture of the Hannah Association now. To retrieve the books of my colleagues and dispatch threats. That's that, and this is this. Isn't that right? Alright, you are. That's that, and this is this. Let us begin. Okay. Okay. Roland will have the Black Silence's page equipped for this fight. Neat. Okay. Oh, I... I... Interesting, okay. Speed 3, nice. Orlando has unique key page and comment pages that cannot be replaced or swapped. Is that true? Huh, lovely. Uh, Black Silence draw two additional pages at the start of the, of the act. All dice on every third comment page gain two power, okay. Interesting. I... can't go to his page I don't think can I I was I was recommended to take a look at the lone fixer passive but it doesn't actually look like I can equip passives so it's just gonna be a one-on-one -on -one, I suppose all right well we'll see how this goes uh huh yep after all that's happened this day has come our past ties have finally led us here Roland right Okay. Oh my god. I don't even know what... Oh my god. I was not done reading that. This page can be used after all after using all nine combat pages of the Black Silence. On hit, inflict five bleed, three paralysis, and three fragile. Okay. So you have to use all nine pages first. Yeah. You're out of energy. Just kidding. That was a joke. Oh my god, you have 226 health? Are you kidding me? For this one fighter forever? Oh boy. Well, if it's forever, that uh, that's quite nice. Okay, we have to beat this. Yes. Yeah, we can beat that pretty easily. Okay, go for it. You got it, Roland. I was wrong. Um. I mean, a 1 in 5 chance to not take damage is pretty good. But I think that this might be better. That was a lie. Okay, well, let's get that one out of the way. I like your odds. I'm a little bit worried about this one.
Or am I? Ho ho ho. Good hit. I'm no longer worried. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay, that's not good. 9 to 20 kind of hurts. I would say that we could do an evasion, but we're not going to evade it, I don't think. What is this, 8 to 11? Well, I mean, statistically, we are we are at an advantage in this one. This one, we should probably just block. Go for it, Roland. You got it. Okay, well, that was not a good scene. <laughs> I, I mean, we're still going to win at the end of the day. Yeah. Yeah. I'm kind of leaning towards this one. I lied. Hey, well, you're out of light. Nice. Um. Okay, easy damage to the Cena, I guess. Yeah, good luck. And we have to use all these cards, so let's get to use them. You won that, huh? You got him. You got him. Oh, he had a light. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Can you use it yet? <laughs> no? Okay. Okay, well, first and foremost, beat this one. Oh, God. Do you even have cards that gave you light? You do. And a lot of light, too. But you don't have any energy, Chief. Oh, boy. <coughs> well, take it. Oh, God. Oh, God. You're okay, Roland. You're fine. Okay, you're fine. You're fine. Right. Yeah, that one's not bad. Let's go with this one. I like I like how much we've got here. And you're only using one card. Oh yeah, we got it. Goodbye. Goodbye. You're about to die. You're about to suffer a lot. No, wait. That's what you like to see. I think this is it. I think this is... Nope, never mind. Not quite, but we got him here now. I'm not gonna lie to you, I kinda wanna see what this page that he has does. The big one. I want to see what his his big mass attack page does. And I don't think that he can kill us. I don't think that he can kill us. That being said, we're still not going to let him win. But, like... We're just going to see what we can do. Yikes. Don't kill him, Roland. Don't kill him, Roland. Be careful now. You're fine. Okay, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. He's down to four. Just let me see what the card does. Sure. Okay, do you have it? Wait, I thought you were mobilized. I thought you got immobilized. What? This is not fair. How many do I have to use? Nine? Oh my god. Okay, Roland, let's get this over with. Just get him out of here. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, <laughs> we're fine. We're fine. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Olivier is no more. We got three of his books, too. Oh, yeah, also, there's something to talk about in a minute, but uh, that's for in a minute. So you were the Black Silence, not just any grade one fixer. You managed to hide that from me for so long. That's, well, uh, a case of missing the right moment to confess it, I guess. Though I do wonder, how are the fixers we've been, we've seen, wait, how are the fixers we've seen unable to recognize you? 
I was about to say, he wore a mask, right? I completely concealed my identity behind this mask back when I worked as a fixer. A tiny bit of personal info being leaked can come back to bite you in the ankle. Oh, wait a minute. I just realized he's the black, he's the black guy, the black silence. The black guy. <laughs> the black, the black silence. He's the black. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what I, yeah, that. <laughs> yep, that's what I said. That's what I meant to say, too. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, boy. That was funny. All right. <laughs> Moving on. All right. <laughs> All right. Moving on. Moving on. If you have any more secrets you've been keeping from me, you'd best, you'd best find them well hidden. Oh, man. I'm sick of being betrayed. I'll make anyone who tries to do so pay the price. Although, you save me this time, so I'll forgive it. I might have suffered serious damage if I was forced to endure a thousand years in my current state. Just doing my job, fam. And you just lost your friend. Are you feeling okay? That's that, and this is this. Okay. Roland's key page has been changed to the black silent. Oh. Forever? Or can I change it back? Uh, okay. Oh. Oh, well we can give him the passives. Well, now we can. Okay, well. Good to know, good to know. Um, well this episode is not over because, oh, my screen appears to have disappeared again. Nice, okay. Uh, well, you know what they say. When it doesn't work, close the game and open it back up. I guess I can use this opportunity to talk about a couple of things. Uh, one, for those of you who are interested, I did record the first part of my vlog today. Uh, that's going to go up, I think Saturday is the plan. Saturday is the plan, we'll see about that though. Uh, as well as what I did before this episode started. So, I actually funny enough, was working on Chisette's apartment, which I'm not going to show yet because it's not done and I want it to be a surprise. But I was working on Chisette's department and I was like, look, I have a theme for this floor, but none of our none of our key page outfits fit the theme of the floor. No, 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 no. I think the game, okay, I was about to say, I think the game just crashed. Anyways, um, but none of the, none of the ego pages that we had fit it. I was like, ah, it's just... It's just not what I need. So I went to the workshop because I like it kept it, like every time you go into the here, every time you go into like the customized librarian thing, it's like, oh, do you want to take a look at the workshop? Oh, OK. So I was like, yeah, sure, whatever. I'll take a look at the workshop. So I got a couple of workshop skins. So I got one for she said, which is kind of funny. I got one for myself. I got one for Riker. And I got one on top of that that I just gave to Carly currently. Um. The Chisette one is actually pretty funny. It just changes him to having... Oh, well, I just... I just ruined the fucking floor. I'm an idiot. Yeah, okay, well, here's the floor. Um... <laughs> yeah, well, here's the floor. Um, we got pirates. It's a pirate floor. What was my inspiration for this? There was a pirate ship in the background of the talks with, with Chisette. That was it. Anyways, well, it's too late for that now. Yeah, so his, uh, his ego, or his key page has been changed to himself, but, like, with a coffee mug, and all his attacks are, like, he just throws coffee on people. It's hilarious. So, yeah, that's what I did. Oh, oh, oh nice. What is this? No, 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 we'll pass. No, we'll pass. Oh God, this might actually be the end of the episode then. Uh, it's a very short one. Yes, I know. That's how it's gonna be, I think though. I don't have anything ready for this. Not a single thing. Not a, literally a single thing. But once we start it, we can't do anything else until it's, until it's done. Well, that feels like a very big commitment that I'm not ready to make yet. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'm going to I'm going to stop the recording and I'm going to make some make some things. We're going to get this done right now. Uh, and I'll be back. God, who knows how long it's going to take, but I'll be back. 
Uh, well, it's done. Everybody has a page now. Is that me saying that everybody has a good page? No, no. In fact, far from it. Um, is it enough so that I think that it's gonna give us a taste of what we're up against? Like, actually? Yeah. I hope I didn't just make a horrible decision. We'll see how it goes. Oh, monologue. They're busting in. Nay, bot click click or Alright. Knock and the door shall open. Talk about stupid strong. Aha! Googie is a test of endurance after all. Whatever you say, sister. Now, friends, you're going to frighten the residents of this place. They might end up hiding. We're intrude we're introducing our whole group to them for the first time, so we should be polite about it, no? They might turn us away if we're too noisy. Oh, I, I just did a whole lot of things I didn't mean to. Holy shit, that's Philip? <laughs> what happened to him? <laughs> Alright, whatever. They might turn us away if we're too noisy. If they do, then they wouldn't have to break in and wreck them. So this is the famed library. I've heard many things about it, but to see it myself. You used to lead a circus in a humble tent for such a long time. And I thank you for changing that. With your help, I could finally step out of that tent filled with a musty spent, uh, scent of flowers. You know how tiring it was to deal with your ants, uh, your anti antics? You almost got one of us pulps. I was not in my right mind at the time. Why, I thought you were simply trying to perform with me. Still, I think it's truly serendipitous that we can walk away the way that we can walk the same path in the end. I feel the same. Zoragalia gave us true salvation. Haha, uh -huh, no, don't mention it, friends. I did too much of an, of an Oswald voice for everybody, it is what it is. I couldn't have done this alone. I should be thanking you all. By the by, it seems no one is here to greet us today. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that every time that that person speaks. What of it? Must have wimped out and hid behind a shelf. <laughs> Are you bought insane? You can't just fling the door open by force. That's a first, I gotta admit. Perhaps it's an indication that the library has grown close enough to the physical realm that it can be interacted with from the outside. We knocked several times too, mind you. If you wrap your dirty fists on a door and no one responds, what you should do is leave, not break in. Don't get your skirt in a twist. We were in a bit of a hurry, so to speak. Pluto, do your job. But of course, I shall see to it that the entrance is repaired in no time. Is that a singularity? Singularity. Such a preposterous, uh, such a preposterous claim. It's magic. <laughs> yeah, okay, buddy. We are the truth. We are truth seekers and artists, perched on the boundary as we search for an answer. You haven't been taken over by the distortion. How is that possible? To eat or be eaten, or walk your fine line at the crossroads. The so-called pale librarian has become fully has become fully human. Huh? She can't even call her pale anymore. She now has blood red coursing through her soft flesh. I have blood red, yeah. No. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, reading is hard. <laughs> I want to rip out every little blood vessel in your body and eat it. The veins of a machine turned human. How will they taste, I wonder? Easy there, Elena. That stuff tastes better cooked than raw. The thought is making my mouth water. I respect your preferences, but please save discussions about them for private conversation. What's your business here, anyway? I don't feel like giving any books to you. Didn't invite you here, either. I, I heard that I heard the answers we seek lies at the library at its very core. I don't I don't even know what the hell kind of a voice to do for Philip. What happened? Philip, what happened? <laughs> and we've come to snatch that book with our forky tongue. Angela, we are aware that you have nearly completed that volume. Who said anything about giving it away? I never said anything about asking permission either. All right, Roland. It's been a while since I got to have a chat with you in peace. You won't talk to me. That's heartless of you. And I had good news for you, too. We brought along the person you wanted to meet so dearly, actually. What? Truth be told, I didn't want her to meet you again. The two of you were comparable to a marriage between a beautiful rose and a rabid beast. Though a love story that ends with the lovers never getting to see each other again would be too tragic, wouldn't you say? So I have decided to take her with us. Oh, bullcrap are you. It's been a while, Roland. Have we met before? 
How can I forget? She wouldn't shut up about you. That's right. Angelica had much to say. Oh, oh God. That's pretty fucked up. Oh, dear. Was it too much? What's wrong? Are you at a loss for words by the reunion of your dreams? What motherfuckery are you trying to pull? There's no trickery here. Or are you so mesmerized by her polished up beauty that you can't stop admiring her? Argalia! How intimidating. What's the problem? You finally met your beloved Angelica once more. Oh, don't tell me. Fell in love at first sight for the second time. Want to steal away Angelica from me yet again? No, you won't. I won't let that happen this time. You don't deserve Angelica. She deserved better than having her life ruined by the likes of you. Okay, so let me take a guess here, right? Argalia was in love with Angelica too, and Roland swooped in and took her, right? Don't you feel anything when you look at the mess you've made out of her? You must be quite bedazzled by your perfected form. You're not gonna croak in peace. You're not gonna croak in peace. I'll chew you up alive, crunch your bones to dust. You're still bound to the past, blind to the present, Roland. You fool. Try looking into the future like I do. You know how hard Jaihan worked for this. Sorting out the corp corpses clustered within the piano was an arduous task, even for me. I went through the, uh, wait. I went through the fair bit of trouble next to him. I had to extract Angelica's blood out of the pile of bodies bloated from the heat. The piano. What? Ha ha ha. Oh my, oh my, was it too early to reveal this? Oh, I'm so sorry, Roland. I didn't ruin your little plan by accident, did I? Is this about, oh, this is where, uh, Look, the names are too similar. Is this about the pianist? Nay, our fur, our boop it up, boop it up, boop up, boop up, boop up, boop it up, boop up. Ah, even I know the fact. All your smarts were good for nothing, huh? <laughs> Poison just get worse and worse as I go along. This show is getting spicier than I thought. <laughs> oh, I was trying to hold it in. I really was. But this is too hysterical. I can't hold back my tears. You naive, moronic heap of scrap. Angela, you're the one who killed that black-hearted bastard's undeserved better half. Do you see it now? You're the one who killed my... Oh, fuck. <laughs> you're, the, you're the one who killed my sister. Yeah, oh. <laughs> God, there's a lot of ha there's a lot happening right now. This is, this is a very, uh, a very, like, story-heavy bit of, of monologue here. Quite a scene indeed. Even I cannot help but laugh at this. White night and dark days caused by the distortion phenomenon, which made the pianist. And you, Angela, are responsible for the white nights and dark days. Relationship couldn't be any clearer. Poor Miss Angela, how can you still be so blind to the truth? Cut it out. Being calmer than I expected this time, rather, rather than, you know, throwing a furious fit. That rabid psycho whopped a whole lot of syndicates and offices that were running experiments which seemed even a tiny bit suspicious. And his blind rampage affected us as well. Roland, I don't expect you to remember us. All I wanted was to bring back my son, who had died in an unfortunate accident. Oh shit, that's that dude. There's no way for me to have anything to do with the death of your wife. I explained it all to you, and yet, he killed my son in cold blood in that workroom. We're such a merciless being. Right, it was a place with a terrible stench. This was unexpected, you actually remembered it. Looking at that puppet, can't help but be reminded of it. I guess you got more skillful since then, even though your disgusting method hasn't changed one bit. No singularity could save my son when he was found. He was in an abysmal state. He was playing in that spot out of- wait, he was playing in a spot that was out of my sight. When he got- wait, well, he unfortunately got in the way of- <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. What the hell kind of a place do they live in? Well, <laughs> the people just keep going? It's not getting the road? They just didn't stop? <laughs> oh my... <laughs> oh my god. I think the person to blame here is whoever was driving that fucking road roller. Alright, alright, alright. I shouldn't have been at work that day, but I still... <laughs> I still wanted to undo what happened, even if it caused everything I had. What's more, the revival of my son was nearly complete. But then you had to intervene moments before our touching reunion and ruin it all. You still insist that thing was your son. Okay. All it was was an abomination made with the flesh of random people weaved together. 
You don't get to decide the worth of my method or the ways of anyone else. Oh, the ways of anyone else here, for that matter. I never did any harm to you. The worst thing I did was use the bodies of children who had already gone astray and, led, and lost their lives during the night. Even so, if the parents of those kids wanted to hold me accountable, I was ready to accept their judgment. Not yours, Roland. You had no right to kill my son who was just about to be given new life, or judge me for my actions. That day, staring at the fire which engulfed all I had, I swore to myself that I'd do everything to make you suffer the same, and to make this damned world suffer as well. There was no- wait. There was no justification for a maniac who was lashing out at blameless people to kill my son. I came across another chance. I could awaken to this power. But I was confused. I lost my way for a good while. My head was brimming with all kinds of thoughts. That was when the orchestrator here reached out to me, and led me to this exact moment. That's that, and this is this. Whatever you'd gone through, you shouldn't have fucked with my wife. It doesn't matter what kind of miserable past you have anymore. I don't even care if I was the reason for your suffering. But you, you! All right. Roland, calm down. What's the matter? This isn't like you. Not like me, huh? You've got the wrong impression, then. Oh. It's a very nice picture. Ah, oh, this is taking such an amusing turn. Oh, okay. Don't get me wrong, Angela. I'm not here to get my revenge like that man with a, with a heart of coal is. It's the opposite, rather. I'm thankful for you, you see. You gave- oh. You gave us the power to reach here, sister. Thank you f for opening up a path that, through which we can reach salvation. Here, we'll take the line of the library and illuminate the city with a beauty that exceeds the pianists. Oh my god, why are these skipping so fast? So that no one will ever be able to forget us. That's why, Angela, you have my deepest gratitude. Let me express my appreciation as well. I couldn't shake him up as I desired thanks to your ignorance. As eager as I am to see what happens with next with googly eyes, we'll have to miss out on it, sadly. Now, get ready then. The song of this city is approaching its coda, and have you your stories and you have your stories to keep, don't you? Roland. Don't say a word. We still have a common goal of stopping Argalia. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I see. Okay, well, we're gonna take a pause for a second and I will be right back. I gotta go fill up my water. Okay, I'm back. So, it doesn't look like I can go up. I can forfeit. Progress will not be saved. Oh, God. Okay. Well, then we're in a little bit of an unfortunate... Okay, so here's kind of, <laughs> here's kind of how this worked, right? So, I started off real strong. I was like, yeah, we're gonna... <laughs> yeah, we're gonna fuck them up. We're just gonna take them to the next... Yeah! Okay, I didn't actually change these guys, but they had pretty good ones. Yeah, we got it. And and then as the further up we got, it was like, yeah, yeah, we got it. Yeah, we got it. And then and then up at the top, it's like, yeah, Kabira, Roland, Bina, yeah. <laughs> it's fine. We'll see how it goes. Oh, we're starting with Philip. Nice. That's a lot of uh, that's a lot of passives. I'm not even gonna read them. We're gonna, we're just gonna jump into it. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it's reading time. Welcome. I'm the patron librarian of the floor of history and your opponent, Malku. Hmm, are you going to say anything? What more do I have to say to you? Are you holding some sort of grudge because you think we took everything from you? Maybe so. You don't have you don't sound all suit all that certain about it. There are remnants of memories and feelings inside me. I'm not sure if I forgot them or lost them though. Those feelings only become more dull and dull over time. I'm not even reading these right, but that's okay. I imagine myself in the past- wait, I imagine myself in the past would have gotten upset and sad over those, unable to let go of all of them. Oh my god. Right now, I'm simply standing here for the- for the- for- Hey, from top. Right now, I'm simply standing here for the performance that will awaken the people of this city like everyone else. I have no hard feelings other than the desire for the light you've kept hidden. Don't you feel that you've lost something important to you? Having my happiness taken away doesn't mean it doesn't always mean that sadness has to fill that space. I haven't become intrinsically unhappier. 
I've simply returned to a past state back when I hadn't realized such emotions, back before I met them. I'm sure I wasn't a miserable man at that time. If you had, to, if you have to part with such emotions and memories, what'll be left for you? Nothing. I don't feel sad about it though. I don't have a voice for him, so he's just, he's just my normal voice. Why are people taught that they must earn things? Jobs, assets, friends, family, knowledge, wealth. They tell us that our lives are made successful and content by acquiring them whenever they may be. Even though nothing in the world lasts forever. What? Uh, yeah. Okay. Can we get to the point, please? Eventually, when people try, <laughs> when people try and fail to latch on them in an unsightly struggle, they despair and lament. I did too. The relationship between people really matter. They all break in the end sooner or later. Can a, oh my God. Can't a person be himself and walk down a path he chose purely on his own without anyone else's intervention? He may seem like a nobody, but it'll ultimately gain more. It's understandable to be afraid of what might happen between people. After all, I had the same fear. Okay, but without such emotions, we can't move forward. So, let me guess. It's going to be a confliction of, of mindsets, right? Call a hunch. It's going to be a confliction of mindsets, depending on the floor. Which means that, like, I don't know. You saw it, it's going to be all logical, and then somebody else is going to be like, I, I don't know. I don't know. That's just my, look, that's just my, my current thought process here. There might be a difficult and trying time, but there's still a lesson to be learned from that pain. I don't know, even if that were true, you're not one to lecture me about it. Such a bold thing to say after taking the lives of people around me. I haven't come here to take revenge, though. Most would say the same. All I want is a free life, one, I'm not ch one where I'm not chained to anything. I'm tired of having to worry about taking flack for anything I do. I guess I don't have any more arguments to make. I don't have a clear conscience about what I'm doing after all. There's only one way to sell this now. It's time for me to do what I must do. Get ready, guys. Okay, team. We're probably not gonna win. <laughs> We're probably not gonna win. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Jesus Christ. He can gain a lot of negative coins, can't he? Okay. Oh, yeah, nobody has passives either because I didn't know if I would need them or not. Hey! Looking back, maybe, maybe, maybe I needed them. <laughs> Looking back, maybe. Possibly. That might have been a good idea. It's a little bit too late for it now, but it is what it is. We're not going to win any of these. This could be fun. I like the music. Please. <laughs> Thank you. Alright, look. Somebody has to break through eventually. It's kind of my, my thought process behind this. Eventually, somebody will land a blow. Oh, you have a counter, though. So maybe not. Well, no, I mean, eventually, somebody will actually still land. We'll see how long that takes. All right. This will be a quick fight. We're not going to win. How the fuck are we supposed to win this? He's not even doing any damage to him, bitch. I probably should have read his passives. Can I restart the battle or will that have negative effects? I don't actually know. I guess we'll find out. Okay, well... Okay, what, 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 is it, what does it say? Take one to two less damage and stagger from all attacks. Nice. Nice, everything costs zero. Cool. Take no damage from burn, even better. Uh, when inflicting burn, you can come at a pay, apply one. Uh, yep. Have the emotion inflict three burn all, including himself. Nice. Uh, if the character has 15 or more burn, at the fuck. Okay, but becomes more vulnerable, so maybe that's not horrible. And there's another stage after he hits 60% HP. So it's actually not horrible that we have burn pages because it's actually going to help us a lot. It's actually going to help us a lot because if we can get them up to this quick... Okay, you need to charge. If we can get them up to this fast enough then we can actually do some solid... do some solid damage to them at the end of the day. Okay, we have to do some clashes. I know it's it's going to hurt, but we... Guys, we got to clash. Uh, except for Henry. Henry is just chilling. Oh, yeah. Short. I would actually rather not use that. I would rather use... Oh. I'd rather use you. What are you gonna do? Probably th this. 
Which one gives more burn in the long run? You inflict on a hit, you inflict. But this was a for sure three, so I'd rather do that. Are we clashing with everything we can be? Yes, 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 yes. Go for it. All right, team. Oh, nice. That's right. You don't actually get to use it this scene. Ooh. You love to see the passives coming through. Good hit. Good hit. He's at 15 now, or at least he will be. Nice. Which means he's about to be very, very weak to stagger. He sure is. I imagine he's also going to fuck us up, though. Well, Rachel, I'm sorry, but if you're taking one for the team, you're taking one for the team. You, uh, you lovely person, you, you're going to have to... You're going to have to suffer a little bit. Everybody else is just going to go for damage, I think. We might lose Rachel here, but let's be real. Rachel doesn't really have the best cards. It's actually kind of a lie. She has some good cards. It is an individual, so it doesn't really matter which one you hit. I suppose that you should try and negate what you can. There's no reason, literally no reason for you not to. If only we had a little bit more energy. That's fine. We're going to get some we're going to get some good good stuff out of this scene. That's okay. I think you can do that. You can take a couple hits for us. Okay. Joking you, actually. Hit that one instead. I know that that means you're going to get Well, actually, you might not get tagged at the end of that. Let's go execute too. We want damage. Damage, damage, damage. That's everything. Except we want... We want you clashing this first one, because you have a really good card. Okay, team. That was a great hit. We might get the stagger. Yeah, we got him. We got him. We got him. Rachel the Queen carrying us with this stagger. Except he's not going to drop below 60%, which is, I think he's literally about to right now. He's literally about to hit 60 I think that's it. Yeah, it is. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Stage one is out of the way. Stage one out of the way. Yes. 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 Oh, my God, you are annoying. Is that it, though? No, it's not. Oh, God. God, I wish you were dead. I'll dice lose. What? <laughs> oh boy. Okay. 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 So if we can, if we take one of these guys out, he's gonna lose power on his dice. We need, a, we need a, an attack team. We need a team solely designed to kill babies. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, I know how that sounds. I know how that sounds. Okay, but it's true. So I think it's gonna be you. You three are gonna be on baby duty. Um, except nobody's act. Okay, ugh. It's actually kind of a rough hit. And you have horrible cards anyways. Well, go for it anyways. What's the matter? What's it really matter? I don't think Rachel's gonna live very long anyways, so... You know what? It is what it is. Yeah... I think we should just focus down one of them, though. Oh my god, get into your, your unlocked state, please, for the love of god. Yeah, I mean, go for it. What's it? What's 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 the damage here? Actually, we need to be we need to be mitigating some damage here. I think Henry needs to take this hit. Having Nikolai's page is good because he's not gonna die. He he does have a, an extra life. Uh, Rachel, on the other hand, does not, and she's already taken quite a bit of hits. So what we should be doing is trying to keep Rachel as healthy as possible so that the whole team can live longer and not just, like, three people. And we need energy, so get some energy cards. Yeah. We're going after this baby over here. Uh, and do that, too. Go ahead and start priming it. Not yet, but you're, you're getting there. That's okay. 
It's not great, but it's okay. And same with that one. I mean, it is what it is. Okay, team break. <laughs> He's endurant. That's nice. I'm glad that I ended up doing that then. Oh, Rachel, on the other hand, is not is not endurant. She's taking a lot of damage. That was a good. That was a good stagger, or not a stagger, but like a good deflect. Okay, that that baby at the top's gotta go. As soon as it's gone, we can start. Uh, we can start whittling down his his effectiveness in combat. Nice, she's unlocked. That's good. That means next scene we can uh, we can do some big hits. Okay, we are also up to the next stage. I think that we have to. They're all very good. This one is very good because if we get it on him, that's great. But I think that we need to keep people alive. Question becomes, who do we give it to? Probably Rachel, honestly. We need a mass attack. Do we need a mass attack? Do we need health? Who would we attack? Let's start there. Probably the baby, so probably the health. Because we can get more of them. Oh, you have one single page? And well, actually, it's okay because you're not taking any damage. Oh, God. You are dead. You are dead. There is no saving you. Go for the big plays. Go for the big plays. It'd be nice if I could overcharge too, but that's not gonna happen. You are also taking a sizable amount of hits. But they're all from the baby, so they're not, like, horrible. Oh my god, you all have nine burn? Jesus. Okay. Well, the good news is, at least, now I know which floor to bring the purple tears page onto, right? If I don't take burn damage, then it's not an issue. And this is this whole floor is about burn. I think that Rachel needs to get some health back, so she's doing that this scene. And I think that we should pick a different baby to use it on. I think we should pick you. And I think that you should come and help, and I think that you should come and help too. But first, keep yourself alive. Keep yourself alive first. First and foremost, you can't uh, die on me. That would be pretty bad. I think you're safe to do this just because of how much power boost you have. And... Go for an execute, I think. Well, no, go for light. Yeah. Well, I mean, at that point, you might as well, right? How much is this first hit? It's pretty bad. You're actually going to get staggered from that. Deflect. Deflect. Do your own damage, at least, if nothing else. Oh, my God. Amazing. You, uh... You've done well. You've done well, Pansy. You can. You'll, you're gonna die. It is what it is. You've made the team proud. Take pride in that. I think we got him. Baby's dead. <laughs> he wasn't expecting us to bring a steamroller to the fight. <laughs> oh man, I know. I'm hilarious. <laughs> do they take burn damage? I don't actually know. I was hoping that you'd do a little bit more. Well, this one's about to this one's about to go. They do take burn damage, it seems. So actually, we don't even need to worry about you. You're uh, uh oh. Uh oh. They're actually not horrible. Okay. Well, let's let's block you. Um. Take another baby. Bottom baby. Bottom baby team. Tend to think I was gonna win this. <laughs> That's pretty good. We can go for a big hit right now, but we have to land it first. We have to land it first is the issue. Reduce power of all opponent sides clashing against this by 12. Never mind, we will win. In fact, it, it almost feels better to use this. To use it against this one, right? Go for it. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. That might have been horrible. It might have been a stupid idea. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. 
Sure. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think you have to. And I actually think you have to go against him. Yeah, look, look, look at his stagger. I didn't even, I wasn't even paying attention. I'm an idiot. Everybody attack him. What are we doing? Why are we worrying about the babies? Attack him. The babies are inconsequential. They don't matter. The queen. The queen. You just got fucked up. So did we a little bit, but to a much lesser extent. You're not going to win this one, Chief. Oh, yeah, we got him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get the stagger, get the stagger. Oh, baby. Why was I not doing this from the start? I didn't even pay attention. He's about to go to his next stage. That's great. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Next stage, next stage. This is it, next stage. I'm worried. What have we got? I think we have to. Give it to Henry. Henry will live the longest. <laughs> yeah? The fuck is this? He's so close. He's almost dead. The babies didn't die, though. I kind of thought that they would. Oh, great, and you got all the vines. How nice. Rachel? That's not good. You're gonna get staggered. However, on a clash win, we do destroy all of the target's dice. As in, like, all of them, all of them? Like, he has no, no dice left for the rest of the scene? You have to stay alive long enough to do it. Okay. I think we gotta go all in right here. It's not much, but uh, team, do what you can. Oh, and Henry's immobilized. That's okay, Henry won't die this scene. I don't even think we care about that. We kind of care about that, but not really. We care more about going in for damage, I think. Who's gonna be around the longest? That's who I want to have this. It's, it's gonna be you. We'll see how this goes. Just don't get staggered immediately, please. Nice, good deflection at the beginning. We are somehow just barely okay. Thank you for taking all the hits, queen. Good hit. Destroy all the dice. Yes, we got him, we got him, we got him. You're okay. And you're okay too. Can't die. Invincible. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's gonna be Henry seen next turn. Gonna be Henry seen next turn. Who's getting hit? Oh god. I am so sorry, Rachel. Do you have unrelenting? Nope. <laughs> nope, that's gonna be a no on that's gonna be a no on that one. Henry? You won't die this scene. You will not die this scene. You will live. And bro buddy? Go for it. You have to go for it. Good hit, good hit. I'm proud of you. It's okay, that's fine, that's fine. Scene's gonna end, Henry won't die. He's gonna come back full health, full, look, big man, big man. Oh God, we lost another one though. It's just Henry and who? Oh God. Worst case scenario right there. Go for more damage. Here's the thing, here's the thing. We're not gonna win, we're not gonna win, but that's not a bad thing. This was just like a test anyways, right? Henry is going to die. Henry is dead. And you're dead too. I would say, for for round one of trying this, this was a very good scene. This was a very good try. This was a very good try. I think literally we could do this right now. But we're not going to. We're going to call an episode. Because I just realized how long we've been recording for. Okay. Well... That's it, that's it. Um, I think next time, don't focus on the babies, focus on him. Go damage, 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 damage. It doesn't matter, He what, what's he gonna do? He can't do anything, he still has full, full, uh, you know, anger, <laughs> I guess. But uh, that's gonna conclude today's episode. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't, leave a thumbs down. If you'd like to see more, consider subscribing. I upload daily at two o'clock and three o'clock. 
As always, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you all in the next episode. So long, everybody. <laughs>